All right, what is going on everyone? Thank you all so much for stopping by the Card Dojo. My name is Sean, and this is my journey into modern day card collecting. Well guys, it is Monday, in fact, it is Tyron Matthew Monday, where we look way back to 2013 in hopes of finding a Honey Badger rookie. Out of this elite box, we already searched for Travis Kelsey. And today we're gonna do six packs, switching it up, looking for the Honey Badger, the landlord. Tyron Matthew for the Kansas City Chiefs. And as you guys know, there are many other um, pretty good rookies that you can pull from this box. So what did I just do there? Let's pull the very last one. All right. So that is six random packs. Um, that would be 13 total out of this box, meaning there are seven left to do one more episode. So if we don't get the hits today, we might catch them later. So should I bring out the hits from last week? Maybe I should, hold on. Before we rip, I always am unprepared. All right guys, like magic, there are the four main hits from the first rip. Um, the Soleil, numbered rookie, the um, Robert Woods, hard hats auto, Drew Brees, numbered mem cards, and a um, Zach Dessert, little um, acetate numbered card. So here we go guys, part two. But this time we're switching it up. Let's get the landlord. Let's find the landlord auto. The honey Badger, come on. We need a Chiefs hit. We're starting off, guys, with Andy Dalton, uh, Jonathan Dwyer, Dwyer uh, Marquise Goodwin is oh, yeah. the auto. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, no small, slow rolling that. Um, we're, we're continuing the streak of pulling Buffalo Bills. So here we have uh, Marquise Goodwin, and I will actually um, sleeve this up. Leave that one up. Not bad. Um, starting out hot. But what does that mean for the rest of the episode? Guys, there are still at least one more hit. We're still at least looking for one more hit. So, it doesn't mean we're completely done yet. It's not all over quite yet. We still have a Marshawn Lynch and a Jamal Charles. That's not bad. Uh, we could still get some more Aztec cards. We still have a Mem card, which as I, as I say that, I pull this pack up and it feels thick. So maybe a double hit day, maybe another double hit day, and what would that leave for um, the last episode? Well, plenty of fantastic rookies, I'll tell you that much. I can tell you that much. Here we go guys, pack two, and uh, is there something backwards here too? And the filler card, okay, so there's a filler card, there's filler cards. so false alarm, but then there's something backwards anyway, so, so now I really don't know. It might just be a um, another die cut, um, the primary colors. So here we have Josh Gordon, um, Philip Rivers, we have Michael Crabtree, Reggie Wayne, and it is a primary colors, um, number 19, and that's probably the Saints. Wait, no. Okay, we'll find out. Sam Bradford, okay. Um, not the worst uh, Rams quarterback that we pull here at the Card Dojo. And there we go, there's the filler, nice and uh, chunky to use for shipping or whatever I may need that for. Usually shipping, sometimes dividing um, in my uh, little my little boxes. Just toss a couple of um, filler cards in there to separate my different um, products. Here we have guys numbered. Terrence Williams, um, $7.99 out of, um, well, $6.71 out of $7.99. Terrence Williams for the uh, Dallas Cowboys, so that's not bad we're not really Cowboys fans you know we do have a secondary PC that happens to be the rival uh, New York Giants but we will stand him up there we have a Jake Locker and finally a Brian Hartline from the Miami Dolphins okay all right guys that is halfway we have another okay yeah see now I'm starting to feel them and they do feel like there's gonna be a couple fillers here so we're gonna stockpile up on the fillers and uh, hopefully save that last hit for the last episode let's see yeah okay there's another filler We'll just take it out now. No need to have any suspense. Okay, Alfred Morris. We got Tom Brady, Tampa. Brady. Back in his old school Patriots uniform. That, that's, that's actually pretty cool. We'll give Tom Brady some some stage. Like he needs more um, time in the center, center stage. Steve Smith. We got Justin Blackman. And uh, Rodney White. Okay. All right, down to two packs. These packs were printed um, June of 2013. So before the season started, 
Uh, it would have been after the draft, obviously. Oh, okay, there we go. So, something different here? Something felt different instantly, but I don't think it's like a, a, a big hit. Uh, Jerry Macklin, you got Peyton Manning. Go. Um, and that's this is what this is. Uh, portraits. Okay. Uh, Andrew Luck. A little like old school. Another acetate. And that's kind of, to be honest with you, a little uh, nightmare. A little nightmare fuel for you. Let's just do this. See? The usefulness of the filler cards. There you go. Um, a little less nightmare. Like 8-bit. Eight, eight it's pretty cool. Um, Panini portraits. Andrew Luck. I don't think it'll be numbered. No. Yeah. Pretty cool. Um, they're, they are actually just full holes. So it's not like a an acetate where it's clear. They are like cut little holes in there. So there you go. Interesting. Pretty cool. We will put him front and center. Right there. Okay. All right. We got two more from this pack. Um, ben Jarvis, Green Ellis. And finally, uh, Chris Givens. So guys, there we go. Some interesting cards. I do like this product. A lot of uh, nice fun. Hold on. Let me get my lights going. Maybe you can see it through Andrew Luck. Yeah, kind of. All right. Slow it down. Slow it down. Calm down. All right, guys. This was the super chunky one that I immediately immediately panicked and said, oh, no. We've uh, blown through all the hits really early. And then I, I toss it to the back. I didn't put it back in the box, but um, we're going to roll with it. And yeah, it is, it is something chunky. So so you can see the chunkiness and you can see the back cards we'll move them to the front okay we have let me sort it out okay Vincent Jackson uh, Jacoby Jones Ryan Matthews um, Andre Johnson Robert Griffin III and alright we got a Buccaneer so honestly I am not sure let's just do a little flip on the count of three one Josh Freeman, and look at that. Josh Freeman with a little number. What is going on here? Oh, on, on the back, okay. So, I don't know what this is. Um, first and goal. So there's like the first, oh wait. I do know what this is. I've seen this maybe, who did it? There we go. There you go. So, yeah. It's the first down marker that you can flip. I don't want to do it too many times. Um, that's about all I'm going to do. And uh, this is numbered 99. Number 9. Would have, been, would have been nice if it was like a really cool quarterback. That's still pretty cool though. A little first down marker. We'll, we'll leave him on the first down. We'll leave him like that. I guess, is this um, part of the jersey though? It's a game worn jersey. A closed game worn jersey that you kind of just like fidget around with, a little fidget spinner. There you go, I'm gonna get set in there. Very nice, very interesting. All right, is that our final hit though? Did we did we burn through all the hits? What do we have left in episode three? Well, I guess we'll have to find out. Maybe we'll search for someone that no one cares about. This way we'll pull something fantastic. So there you go, guys. That was uh, the Honey Badger, Tyron Matthew Monday. We didn't quite hit any Chiefs. Well, we got the Jamal Charles. So we got a little, a little um, Chiefs PC action. No Giants whatsoever. But hey, another Buffalo Bill. So there you go. All right, guys. As always, thank you so much for stopping by and take care.